just off this beach is one of the most shark infested spots on the planet. I'm Anna Gilligan and tonight we're going to drop people into this ocean to see if sharks are really out to get us on the Shark Attack Experiment Live. When I got the call to do this project, I thought, wow, well, we got the danger element, we got the shark element, this is awesome. In a two-hour live show, our team of testers will try to figure out why sharks bite us by putting themselves in harm's way. I'd be lying if I said that I wasn't apprehensive about some of the experiments or situations that we're going to find ourselves in. Really hope and pray that things don't go wrong. Is it dangerous? You bet. But they think it's the best way to get vital new information. Experiments are going to be difficult because hopefully we'll find out a lot of stuff that will, that will have a, give us a better understanding of sharks and their behavior and how humans and sharks interact. But there's always that sort of rogue shark and there's always the opportunity that, that even though we know everything that we know, something can always go wrong. You don't always know 100% how sharks will react in a situation. They are wild animals after all. Well, I've had plenty of sharks bite my camera, my fins. I kind of pride myself on never being bit myself. But if there's one project I would get bit on, it'd probably be this one. Be sure to follow us on natgeotv.com forward slash shark attack for live updates from the field as we prepare for shark attack experiment live in about eight hours.